oh boy, I can't wait to stream an actual Super Famicom game on a Super Famicom. That's right, we're going to be playing Mickey's Magical Quest, the uh, Super Famicom version today. Get, uh, get, get in there, get in the Super Famicom. Yeah, buddy, that's the ticket. Yeah, it's time for Japanese Boner Wizard. Yeah, it's time for Japanese Boner Wizard. Yeah, it's time for the Boner Wizard chat. If you don't know what I'm saying, you'll see very soon. As you can see, I'm using actual Super Famicom hardware. Boner Wizard desu! Ha <laughs> ha, it is I, Count Muck! And I'm taking over your stream! No, 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 stop it, no, yeah! Hello, hello, is this thing on? Mic check, mic check. This is the Dark Lord Stan here. And you have failed me yet again, Count Muck, your countless blundering. You idiot, you boob, you boob. If you fail me again, you'll be out of a job. Is that what you want? No. You will mess with this young man's stream, or I will send you to... Detroit! <laughs> Did you hear that, Clyde? We're back in business! <laughs> so that means we get to be live from my castle of evil in Frankenstein, Missouri. <laughs> yes, now I can do the evil. I'm not going to Detroit, no sir. I've been to the turret. It is not good. So let the evil commence. What terrible movie will I have planned for you? Well, let's see. Hmm. Hmm, yes, it is good. What is evil? I know. I will show you shitty caveman movie. Yug! Enjoy the shitty caveman movie, you fucks. <laughs> Why do you have me tied up, you fuck? Because I can! Also, it's evil! Evil is good, yes? Ah, so we really don't have to go to the trait. No, Clyde, do not worry. We will not be going to the trait. I'm gonna go pack my bags, boss. You are such a pessimist! Yuck! That certainly is a caveman name, yes, it is. But the caveman name is no good, yes. Starring Arch Hall Jr. as Tom! But where is Dick? And where is Harry? Get it, Tom, Dick, and Harry? I got the joke. <laughs> He's good joke, yes. He's best. <laughs> now you will watch the Sheet Caveman movie. It will be good for you. Yes, it will be best Caveman movie ever. I swear it. When I think of caveman movies, I think of rockabilly music and twang. Ah! Screenplay by First Day Blast Name. Yes, the evil it's working, Clyde. We won't have to go to Detroit. Oh, good. Your legs aren't made for whacking in our brass. What does that even mean, Clyde? What does that even mean? Nicholas Merriweather, attorney at law, when you need an accident. Or if you've been in an accident, call Nicholas. Either way, you're gonna need Nicholas Merriweather. Attorney at law. <laughs> Bright lights, big city, right? Will you stop? I'm gonna punch you! Mm, you can't punch me, I'm going to turn into a bat. Whoosh! I'll get you! Oh yeah, 
have the fabulous 1960s. No recessions whatsoever. No coronavirus. Joe Biden is still alive, but he's not president. I'm going to get in my e fuel efficient in car and go ready. Right you can't make jokes. I'll joke you, buddy. Uh, are you propositioning me? No, I am not propositioning you. I don't want to make a business deal with you, buddy. Hi, Roxy. What are you doing in town? Thought I was to meet you up at the club. Well, you still are. Quality I'm microphone. Oh? Yes. See? That? Is this guy looks like he's a Buddy Holly clone, like Buddy Holly went into a transporter accident. He does kind of look like a shitty Buddy Holly for a shitty caveman movie. <laughs> well, I hope you like the shit storm. That's my girl. Her father's Robert I. Miller. Writes all his adventure books. Rin! His name is literally Rin! He has a Rin job! <laughs> get it? Get it? It's good, right? It's good, yes? Will you leave my room? Gee. Never! I'm sorry, sir. I guess I was thinking about having dinner with my girl. She dinner with his girl, girl, you say? Fast times at Richmond Higher! Slow times at Caveman High! Oh boy, I sure hope I don't drop my big gulp! Oh no, my big gulp! Oh, talk about a big gulp! Oh look! It's a caveman! Yes, I see that. I know, but I have no better things to do. He's gonna welcome her to his club, isn't he? Is that the play on words? You better believe it. I hope that you get torn to beats, you fuck. Did she just make a coat noise? Oh. You can say he's the go. <laughs> you know, this guy probably has a podcast now. Oh fuck, it's the police. Yes, hello ma'am, where are the police? Oh wait, it's it's his it's our It's Diet Buddy Holly, never mind. No matter what happened. Oh, is he gone? Who? Is he? Is who? I don't see anybody. Just take it easy and tell me what happened. I saw a giant. What? Right there. Honest, I saw a giant. A giant what? I'll show you a giant. Oh, Tom, your cock is average size at best. Do you really have to make that joke? No, yes. Now get out of my room! No. I'll kill you no, when I get a tight He doesn't believe me. You didn't really expect anyone to Oh hey, it. now it's Diet Vincent Price over here. It's, I can't believe it's not Vincent Price. Dad, I didn't say he was a monster. He was a giant. Oh, he was a caveman. Club and all, eh? Yeah. What my I mean, they're regular. They were mostly regular-sized cavemen. This is a giant caveman. 
But if you see your giant again, let me know in time to take some pictures. She will. <laughs> Dad, you don't believe me either. Roxy, of course I believe you. I believe you saw something. I believe you can fly, Roxy. Fly Air Lingus. That's right, Air Lingus, Ireland's number one airplane service. That's a joke was terrible. You're terrible. Thank you. But flattery will get you nowhere, Buster. What about you? Why do you like this blade? Bass, I'm attacking from China. I'm just doing this massacre. Well, then. Maybe we can get some flashlights and go out and take a look for ourselves. Who are you? Just like Buddy Holly. Now you kids go and take your swim before the pool closes. I'm going to enjoy my cancer stick. Ah, oh, cancer. Mmm, delicious. Good morning now. He is in flavor country, isn't he, Clyde? I, I, I quit smoking three years ago. Best decision of my life. Dad still doesn't believe me. But sure does he believe it is butter? And neither do you. No, I don't actually well, believe it's butter. Presley LP. How big did you say he Elvis was? Presley, let's play? Saw. Let's play Elvis it's Presley? Scared, huh? huh. It means long playing record to Thomas. Feeling he wouldn't hurt me. Yeah. In fact, I thought it was kind of cute. Oh. He was pretty fly for a cave guy. Mm. Meanwhile, it's scenic Utah. So, this is where you dropped your big gulp last night. Yes, this is where I dropped my big gulp last night! No, Dad, I didn't. There was a giant. A giant what? You know, a giant man! A caveman, even. Not right now, son. I'm smoking and talking down to my daughter. A giant big foot, you say? Hmm. I know, it's rather impressive. Son, your cock is average size at best. Say it. A giant. A giant what? what? Mm -hmm. that's I'll find a big boy himself for it if you feel like that. Big boy? Hamburgers. Well, Yum. Right this is that's a lot of jokes per oh. minute, you fucks. Maybe you should slow down and let them see more. You get out of my room! Never! Go back to no, he's my giant. Wasn't that an Arnold Schwarzenegger movie, My Giant? Yeah, I think it was, wasn't it, Clyde? I don't know, Bruce. Was it? Yeah, we gotta look down and leave it in Shadow Mountain. You suppose that's where he lives? Live and learn. That would account for his never having been seen before. It's too bad we didn't bring the doom buggy, but go after him. What for? I have to get some pictures. Maybe even to bring him back. A lot of people aren't gonna believe this giant jazz. No, we're not sending about this, you understand? Why not? After the way everyone laughed at me. Your turn will come. Your turn at the okay. fun new game Monopoly! Did you write a book about the giant, Mr. Miller? That's the idea, Tom. I'll take you up there. My doom buggy's all ready to go. No, thank you. It is, I just gave it the works. There's no offense, son. How do you put a doom buggy to work, son? That was a terrible joke, you know. Get out of my room! Never, evil never dies. Burger and fries. <laughs> yes, he's good, right? He's best evil. I hate you so goddamn much. Similar bucko. Or should I say fucko? <laughs> Don't drop your big gulp. This thing's supposed to be safer than my dune buggy. All right, Kruger, let's go. 
Kruger, Freddy Krueger, Pilot of the Stars. God, I hope he doesn't spill his milk gulp again. So what are we looking for, sir? A giant! A giant what, sir? Oh, you! I know you want to keep watching this shit the caveman movie, but unfortunately, we have sponsors! And they, oh my ass, evil, evil even I can't describe. Who is good, yes. He's best evil. Lately I've been having a problem with fairy spirits and boggling, sir. Whatever shall I do? I have an idea, but we need to go over to there. Right now, in fact, we need... Really? We need to go over where? Help me with the spirits, fairies, and boglins. Have you had problems with fairy spirits and boglins? Well, we have the answer. It's a fucking triangle. You mean, uh, this triangle here? That's right, that triangle right there. You two can no longer be spirited away by spirits, ghosts, boglins, or fairies with the anti-fairy triangle. Buy it now. Buy it now. Science, technology, all these can be yours when you join the army. Now don't you forget, I want you to meet me at the mouth of Deep Canyon tomorrow at four. For what, sir? Four dollars? Oh god, I'm surrounded by idiots. I know that feeling I'm surrounded by you is good, right? His best joke. I'll kill you when I get close, I swear. Is that a UFO? I know it's just a caveman. Never mind, it's just a caveman looking at a helicopter. Me never seen giant metal bird. Be attack! The wonders of Utah. Come visit Utah. Uh, I miss Matt painting. Who is Matt? Get out of my room! I swear I'll kill you! Get out of my fucking room! Hey, is this. Is this caveman music? Is this. This is what qualifies it. Oh, there, there he is. No. Get him! Oh, no. Kill him! Murder him! No. Oh, that's lame. I wanted to see him get bashed his boglins in. Uh, is, is this copyrighted music? Uh, hello there. We are here at, uh, the, uh, stream. We, the copyright is a different kind of evil. An evil we don't even want to talk about, right? Yes, yeah, I agree for once. Thank you. Ooh, you, just like Buddy Holly. 
Play Wonderwall. And now Wonderwall. Baby, baby, you're going to be the one who saves me. Maybe, maybe, after all. You're my Wonderwall. This guy has pepperoni nipples. He does, doesn't he? The wonders of 1950s hairspray. Gallons of oil wasted. Okay, what do you want to talk about? Anime? I like anime. You ever heard of Astro Boy? It's pretty freaking neat, okay. You know, Azuma to, you know, Tezuka? Fucking uncultured. Normie. Is it a Buddy Holly bullshit? Just imagine it, 1960s weebs. This joke is terrible. You're terrible! Yet again, flattery will get you nowhere, friend. Just like this guy's song! <laughs> well, we're probably getting copyright struck. Hello. It's better than going to Detroit. I swear it is. I swear it's better than going to Detroit. Yeah, Detroit kind of sucks. No offense to the people who live in Detroit. Just a minute. I mean, I live in St. Louis. Do you know yeah, it is as bad as Detroit. Yeah. Now you think about it. Yeah, sure? St. Louis is kind of short sure, too, man. Freddy Krueger, pilot to the stars. Thanks for calling. Goodbye. What's up? The sky, of course! From the airport. The helicopter blew a gasket or something. He won't be able to pick Dad up. At Deep Canyon? Yes. No problem. We'll get the dune buggy and we'll whiz right out there. This is whizzing? Wait till we get off the highway. You're gonna get your motor running? Gonna get off the highway? Gonna love it, Brace! Did he say Tartar Belt or Carter Belt? Surf Rock! At KC99, St. Louis's real rock radio, Surf Rock Week! Rock me, sexy caveman! We you, you say. I'm sure it'll be successful as the Wii was. Come on, Dad's waiting.
And yeah, we'll be right back after these messages. Ah! Hello there, folks. This is I, Dr. Pippi. Have you ever had your head explode like this poor fella? <laughs> That's why you and your family need to buy insurance. Head explode insurance. Yeah, yes. Dr. Pippi's head exploding insurance. You want to be safe. You don't want your head to explode. Call now. Call 1-800-EXPLODING-HEAD for more information. That was Surf Rock Week here on KC99, St. Louis's real rock radio. There you are, Deep Canyon. I don't see Dad anyplace. Maybe we're early. How the fuck would we be early, man? What are you, a dumbass? Sadly, we dropped our big gulps again. We're really running that joke into the ground, aren't we? What do you suppose happened? Oh, nothing happened. He's not coming on a bus, you know. You can't expect him to be right on the dot. I know, but he should have made it for dark. Don't worry about it. He'll see the campfire and come walking in on us any minute now. That's what you said two hours ago. Well, he will. Well, if you believe that, what's the idea of the bed rolls? Look, I carry all this junk in the bed rolls. Anyway, so you might really, you huh? I'm not sleepy. So just lie down, take a rest for a while. I keep the fire going. Time's a wasting. Ah, Chekhov's hey, gone. What are you doing with that? I always carry a gun in the desert. You the could say it's the caveman's gun. You know there's mountain lions around here too. Well, they won't come here. But will there be bears and tigers? Oh my! How do you take a shot if something turns out to be dead? Okay, okay. I'll put it away in one condition: that you crawl in and get some rest. Okay. Oh God, is he gonna do another song? Please don't do another song. Man, it's amazing that he can summon whistling out of thin air. Like that. Oh boy. More songs. No, oh, thank God, Deus Ex Caveman here to stop the shenanigans. Where is Shubido coming from? I am Caveman. Do not understand the concept of diegetic sound. Wait, I do actually. That sound is not diegetic. I will now tell him on my TV Tropes page. If I had a billion dollars 
If he had a billion dollars, this movie would be better. I look at it the more this guy looks fake like he's made out of wax or something now who's Valerie why don't you come on over what Valerie would you like to know? without being a fool out of me why don't you come on over Valerie I don't think this could ever work I don't like that song nope maybe you should write something like beach blanket bingo or something that'll be cool right maybe create an album called pet shop boys Okay, let's see what you Tom is about. The, the giant, giant what? A giant uh, what? Giant you can say you that this joke is getting a little too big bad. for us, right? <laughs> Get out of my room! Oh, that was diegetic music. No kidding. Yeah, sometimes a bump starts it off and you gotta hit it again to stop it. Is that a carpet or a blanket she's in? Hello, I am Kevman. You have to tell you about nine diegetic music. Me club you to death, so you understand good, yes, mm. Ah, uh, he knows what water is good. He gets to live today. You can say he is taking the big gold. Get that out of my room. Never, Buster. I'm going to leave in your closet in Jericho. <laughs> Oh no, he's being scared off by the diegetic music. Oh, I must have bumped it again. You must have. You bumped your head! Hey! Have you been at this? We were saving for Dad. What? The stew. I didn't touch it. Well, I sure didn't. And look at... Da, da, da! Caveman Club. What'd you do that for? Listen, if he comes back for that club, we don't want to be anywhere around here. What about around there then? Ah, yes, day for night shots. Wonderful. Quality filmmaker. What are we? Cinema scenes or something? No, oh, I'm better than that, I swear. What? It's some sort of, uh, camera, I think. Are you sure it is? Well, I borrowed it enough. Look at where it's smashed. Well, he could have dropped it. Well, then why didn't he pick it up? Well, it's broken. It's no good to him. Oh, well, it's also insured. Let's not kid ourselves. Well, let's not jump to conclusions either. Come on, let's try that next ravine. Go. 
exciting Dougie. D Dougie, yes, English. English is good, yes? That is my line, you fuck. Don't take that from me, mister. Ah yes, more matte painting. Who is this Matt you keep talking about? It? Is it Matt Frank of the Godzilla? I love his artwork. It is very good, yes. Good, but also the peaks evil. <laughs> no, you better stay here. No, there's no reason both of us going. We gotta come back to the buggy anyway. Well, then we'll come back. I'm not going to sit here doing nothing. Oh, I should probably be Chekhov's gun. Look, you stay here with the buggy. Nope. And drive it up to meet me when I give you the signal. That'll save us both a trip. Come on. Well, okay. Ah, okay. uh, the gun. Toss it. Oh, yeah, we definitely need Chekhov's gun for the end of the plot, right? Yeah, for the plot, right? Yes, for the plot. Give me a blast in that horn if you see anything. Don't worry about that. Exciting jabroni action this time, Dragon Ball Z. I should have brought a big gulp. That would have been a good idea. Or maybe a Game Boy? Oh wait, this is the 1960s! They didn't have Game Boys! Well, broke the fourth wall! What? Patrolling the Mojave Desert makes me wish for a nuclear winter. Oh no, a caveman! Luckily, he has Chekhov's gun! Me tell her about non diegetic music! Smooth moves, x lax Yes, it was about as smooth as you last night, boss. Don't tell him about the do! Clyde, please don't tell him about my dating profiles. It is no good, right? Oh, really? The caveman is after a girl named Roxy. I think you put on the red light, then. Aha! Get it, boss? Oh, her father is alive. I'm somewhat disappointed by this. Is it me, or does he look like kind of a discount fat Walt Disney, right? Y you can see it, right? No, I can't, boss. Well, back in the 60s, I and Walt had some pretty cool times. Torturing children to drain their essence. I mean, building a theme park, yes, is, is good evil, yes, is best evil. Have you put on the red light? Roxy. Have you put on a red light? Roxy? Roxy! Dad. Oh, Dad! Oh! Oh, are you hurt? 
I think my collarbone's broken. Here, let me I mean, I didn't get clubbed by a caveman. How did you get here? Well, we came looking well, for you. Well, you, Bob, had sex, Dad. And we were so worried that we didn't know what to do. No, no. No. No, no. No, no. She's mine. She's mine. He understands you. Oh, he's got a beautiful friendship going. We played Nintendo Wii games last night. What the fuck's a Wii? You'll know soon, hey, daughter. Dad. Don't do anything to scare him. Me scare him? Smile. Smile. He likes your perfume. Smell all you want. Go ahead. What became of the others? What others? Keep smiling. You didn't come out here alone, did you? No. Tom's with me. I mean, what about Dick and what about Harry? He's just curious. Hold still. It's Hold real, it, see? What's he doing? Looking for lice, I believe. Oh, Careful, honey. Take it easy. He won't hurt you. He hurt you? No. I did that myself when I fell on the camera. Dad, I think you better break this up before I scream. Tell him you're hungry. I'm not. Huh? Think of the alternative. I'm hungry. Mm -hmm. Yes, hungry. Thank goodness this caveman understands English. Ah, uh, they're, they're mummies, and they are alive. The mummy's alive, even. They're dead. Yes, apparently for some time. So this is the whitest uh, Native American caveman ever. That sounds like a band name, White Caveman American. But we'll think it's kind of old. He's telling his family. Wano? That's an arc in One Piece. What's a One Piece? Oh, I'm going to tell you incessantly. I'll be the vegan fan of anime. What does that even mean? You will understand one day. A human being. And a real human being. Hello, my son. You well, must go. You're the last son of Krypton, and also a caveman for some reason. Shake hands with him, Roxy. Oh, Dad. Oh, please meet you. Does he know they're dead? I think so. I just can't make himself accept it. I'm not having any trouble. Oh boy, I bet that feels like beef jerky. Your mom feels like beef jerky. Get out of my 
Ah, so it's a plate of ribs. Ding! It looks like one of those giant turkey legs you get at the theme park, you know what I'm talking about, right? Yeah, I know exactly what you're talking about. Why am I still here, my room? Good thing he still has Chekhov's gun plus one of plot armor. Ah, he has to fight the one true enemy, furries. I can't eat any more of this. Ted would like to apologize on behalf of the British Broadcasting Corporation. He knows that furries are people too. He just thought it would be funny. Sorry, furries. Ega. Is that his name? It might be. That's the word he says most of the time. Ega. Oh, Dad, no. That's all I need now is a good drink of milk. Ooh, I don't know. Anybody could drink that horrible stuff. It's worse than. Oh, God, I can't think of any. I guess it can't hurt me. Uh, oh, well, let me just try it. Last it. as long as you can. He won't hurt you if you're doing something. A prehistoric gentleman, huh? <laughs> Thank you. Get it again, another cool well, band here name. To see you. Oh god, it tastes like Everclear! You have to be strong to drink in the first place. No, no, I'm still thirsty. Thank you. That does Now they're just playing charades. Now they're just playing charades with each other. Where's his deviant art page? I want to commission him. Well, at least it's better than modern art. You can say it's prehistoric art. He's good, right? He's best evil. These are the jokes here. You can lighten up while I'm trying to torture you with the shitty movie, at least. Dad, Get the fuck out of my room! Look at this drawing! It's me in my car! This... It's me! Where's my big gold bat? That joke is dead. Please Roxy. stop. Me, Kevman. Roxy! Why don't you put on a red light? If Ika makes me drink any more of this sulfur water, I'll die. We've got to keep him busy. I know. And it's not so bad, as a matter of fact. A little bitter. But it seems to have a certain quality that's good for you. I wouldn't be a bit surprised if the sulfur in these walls isn't what's kept these giants alive all these years. You mean these giants have always been here? Where have you seen those before? In that cave in France. Exactly. Sure. Same style, same everything. Definitely prehistoric. Well, I mean, yeah, it's historic because we, you know, we have history now, Dad. I... Are there others? No, he's the last one. How can you be sure? I took a good look at his family. From the condition of the shrouds, I'd say the last one died 50, 100 years ago. Let me tell you about good diet and how aliens did not build the pyramid. Me can man. A stumble. A stumble. Here it 
Oh, I thought he was saying Duplo, like the building blocks there for a second. Sit, sit, human, sit! You know what, I respect the fuck out of this guy doing this caveman act. I really do. He's giving it his all. He's really giving it his all, this caveman actor. Good thing I still have Chekhov's gun. Well, they could say the best part of waking up is, in fact, Folgers in my cup. Sadly, I only have water. Is that Bronson's cave, you know, the famous one? I don't know, actually. Clyde went there once, didn't you, Clyde? Eh, yeah, that was cool, actually. Roxy? Why don't you put on a red light? Roxy. Why don't you put on a red light? The Roxy. English! It's you, Dad. Go see if the Roxton place is gone now, so this means we can finally leave and I can, you know, it's there. keep pudding again? What can I do? Help me back. I gotta sit down. No, no. Don't touch it. It's got to be tied up with something, doesn't it? You gotta touch it to do that. I don't see it. He brought it here. Must be around someplace. Keep looking, you probably hid it somewhere. Where is somewhere, Dad? Oh god damn it, you're stupid. The aspirin's in that small pocket. Hey, hey, Dr. K, I need some pills and I need them today. My pants are not on fire, daughter. My pants are not on fire. What can I do? Nothing. I'll just sit here. How about if I washed your face? Or gave you a shave? It'll make you feel better. You've got all your junk here. Yes, he does have all of his junk there if you get what I'm saying. Get out of my room! Never! Ah, a shave and a haircut. That costs two bits, right? Oh, down. oh, now the caveman's not gonna recognize them, isn't he? Yeah, he probably won't recognize them. They won't be a part of his...
club anymore. <laughs> Get out of my room, I swear. Uh, here comes our protagonist, question mark, with Chekhov's gun. Into the cave! I like this caveman. How is he the villain again? Uh, no, I'm seriously. How is he the villain movie? Look at him. He's just a nice fella. Say he's not gonna shut my back door. Ho -ho! Me caveman, don't get that joke. Me caveman, them caveman. Now I suppose he wants a shave. That'll be two bits. We can slit his throat and escape! No, daughter, I want you to actually cut his mangy beard. Yeah. Oh, yes, it's our protagonist with Chekhov's gun yet again. You mean the lizard? No, not the lizard! Get the f out of my room! Oh no, it's not whipped cream, that shaving cream! Don't eat it, caveman! With that shaving bomb. <laughs> this has got to be someone's fetish. I look at it, the more this guy looks like a prisoner with his striped shirt. Like he's a discount Ken, like Prison Ken! Not with gun! You did a better job of shaving him, Roxy. Oh no, he's a Chad! No way of telling how old that fellow is. The Chad Caveman versus the Virgin Protagonist. Your 
he really does have a Chad ass jaw. And kind of a. Uh... You got kiss bullets! I don't kiss on the first date! I just realized something. This caveman might smell awful. This might be his first bathing in literally weeks, months, even. Oh no! Please don't! No! Caveman! I was rooting for you, caveman! No! These smell pretty too. Hmm. Where's the Please don't no don't be bad touch caveman be the Chad caveman the Chad man if you will Take it. I'll bet you have a city like that before. Don't you think it's pretty? Do you like it? Give him something else. Oh no, he's actually going to become the it though? Yeah, I know, right. I was rooting for him until now. Even I think this is a kind of evil that I just don't like. It's it's not good evil. Showing you a shitty movie, yes, but uh, this bad touch Charlie over here? No, thank you. Oh no, don't be bad touch Charlie! Don't be bad touch Charlie! Please, caveman! We're all rooting for you! It's okay, daughter. I like to watch. Good thing he's got his club of bonking. Well, he's coming in her back door, I guess. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba 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 -ba. Really? You're going to joke about that, you fuck? Even I'm not that evil! Oh, that is terrible! What do you think, Clyde? I'm, I'm still panting for the train. But we live in St. Louis now. No, wait, we live in Frankenstein. I fucked up. Bass, have you taken your medicine today? No, Clyde, I forgot. I miss my wife, Clyde. I miss her a lot. The protagonist is about as menacing as a poodle. Menacing as a chihuahua, even. Well, wait, nope, nope. As an owner of a chihuahua, that's actually pretty menacing. Never mind, let's go with... I know, menacing as a hamster. Don't be this way! You're a Chad! Look at your jaw! Thank God I have Chekhov's gun here with me. Is this Andre the Giant? He looks like Andre the Giant a little bit, right? He looks a little bit like a young Andre the Giant. And I'm gonna tell you that Hulkamania is not running wild here, it's cave media, baby! Oh no, he's got him in the suplex, Charlie! What do you think about this, Charlie? Why is my name Charlie? I don't know, Charlie. You can say he rocked her world. Ah, finally, Chekhov's gun pays off. Me, Kevman, rock her world. Wait, we did that joke already. Kevman don't understand joke. Kevman wants woman. Get after them. The Doom Buggy. 
Wow, Chekhov's gunman over here is literally useless. Worst protagonist in a long while. Oh no, not Chekhov's gun! Yeah! Give him the Stone Cold Stutter! No way can uh, Diet Buddy Holly over here even hurt this chad of a man. Look at him! Yeah! Get him! Oh wait, no wait, he's the villain, never mind. You can say he rocked his world. Yep. But where's Dick and Harry? Everything's all right. Dad! He's okay. He's waiting for us. Rock, caveman's one weakness, which is ironic. Man, this is some discordant ass violins. Run, kids, run! You better outrun my gun. Run! Okay, who's been messing with Microsoft Music Maker? Yeah, you never know when a caveman might come along and try to steal it. Quick, use Chekhov's shovel! I don't think this is working, Clyde. I don't think we're torturing him with the shitty movie. Clyde, what are you doing? Getting ready to go on the plane, boss. We're, we're just gonna go to the trailer, boss. Well, that's just not fun, Clyde. I, I, I'm a professional, Clyde. I, I truly care about my work, Clyde. Look, boss, let's, let's just go to the train. I'm a little bit there for like three days, and then the Dark Lord Stan will forget about it. Okay, I guess. But after the shitty movie, I've got to see what the, the, the caveman means now. He's gonna rock him like a hurricane. Good thing you can't see us moving! Oh, uh, that's the Tyrannosaurus Rex of Jurassic Park, honey. That way.
Thank God for poor caveman depth perception. Everybody okay? Honey? Just fine, Dad. What I guess totally suspicious in? caveman in the background. So long, high pockets. <laughs> me lonely. Perhaps me shouldn't have come on so strong. Later on, the caveman will get a very profitable ruffling. Ruffling, yes, English, Ted. You speak worse English than Johnny Bigman, my friend from back in high school days. But you're a vampire, you're over hundreds of years old. I didn't say I went to high school as a teenager, now did I? Yeah. That is the name of the movie. Haha, <laughs> you get it. I did it was the setup for the joke the whole time. Good, right, Clive? Clyde? Oh, God damn it, he went to the airport. Well, it looks like I'm taking a Uber to the airport so that I can go to Detroit. Chad Caveman Seeks Wife. He's a bloodhound too, so you can track her by her scent, and then we'll have her been eager too this time. It's cave personal. Smell for the Dad is another good band name. Or a good album name. Either one. How is the movie still on? The, the story is over. Rock on, cave, Chad. Well, my Uber is here, but one day I will be back to show you more shitty movies. Why? Because they, they kind of like hanging out with you. Get the fuck out of my room! Well, Buster, if you can't be my friend, you'll be my friend to me! <laughs> Anyways, I have to go now. I have to meet Clyde at the airport. He has, he has the tickets. Oh, now that I'm back in control, I guess we're gonna finish this movie here.
seats in the car. Now, baby, I just had one. That's all, just one, baby, that's all. I've just had one. One bottle. Hey, baby. You've had enough. Well, I'll tell you when I've had enough. You do me a great injustice. Oh, he's a wandering caveman. Wherever he'll go, he's wandering all over America. Solving crimes, doing right, being a caveman. Now on NBC, Thursday nights at 9, Wandering Caveman. Please don't do it, Iga. I've come to like you over this movie. It's not a good movie, but I've come to like you nonetheless. Roxy! I'm ready, Dad! Have you put on your red light, Roxy? You're gonna have to help me. I can't manage the tie. Here, I'll do it. <laughs> Does it have to be this one? Young lady, that happens to be one of my favorite ties. But the color. You gave it to me four years ago. <gasps> Why, it's lovely. Are you sure you're feeling well enough to go out tonight? Honey, we've got to go out. Well, it's not anything special. It's just a party. Mm, your whole gang will be there. Yeah. You can't avoid them forever. No. Some of them laugh a little. Well, if I know Agnes Henderson, she'll laugh a lot. Mm, me caveman found convenient plot device. What'll happen to him? I don't know, but I'm certain we're doing the right thing. If we were to reveal that a giant actually exists, there'd be a whole army out there tracking him down like an animal. No, they wouldn't. We no, I mean, they're, they're giant people. You know, they live on the I Earth mean, currently right age. now. Another eon. Come in. Hello, Mr. Miller. Hello, Tom. Wow, the wow, wow. You sure look swell, Roxy. Thank you. How long How about you swelling at all? Is That's an wrong, insult. Mr. Miller? God, you two are stupid. Adventure. Oh, I see. You do? Well, sure. A girl like Roxy don't get over a thing like that right away. Doesn't. That's what I say. She's got to get her mind off it. And this hop tonight will help. Hop? Yeah, my combo's going to be there. And they swing. So I understand. I'm ready. Well, let's split then. Uh, Mr. Miller, I got my dad's wheels tonight. Really? Do they fit on your car? I was going to make that joke. I was going to make that joke.
Uh, he can do something that a millennial will never do. Own the home. I'm depressed now. Is that a fire exit? Did they just forget to put the fire exit out of the prop here? Oh, we're in a club, I see. That makes sense. Well, I mean, he's also a caveman, so he's also carrying a club. Hee-ho. I mean, he is giant. He is bigger than you by, like, a few inches, friend. the same thing? I mean, a giant isn't a secret species of human. Oh boy, it's more of this jabroni's rock. Sir, don't quit your J-job. J-job! English, Ted. God, maybe I should have picked the cave band instead of this guy. Oh, Jesus, there's still that much time left on this movie. His music is, in fact, awful. His music is really awful. Yeah, nobody lives there because of your music. No, I don't. I agree with you 100%. His music is awful. I agree. What on earth are you talking about? Getting as far away as possible from that music is a good idea. <laughs> no, the music yeah. Is I could listen to Tom sing by the hour. And you have. I just wanted some fresh air, that's all. Is it, honey? No. Dad, I've got the funniest feeling. What is it? That we're being watched in some sort of movie stream on the internet! Him? Iga. The giant. Or whatever he is. Something's happened to him. Roxy, look at me. I love you very much. You're more like your mother every day. Every living thing was her personal concern, and she worried about them. That's just it, Dad. But just see, worry isn't the feeling that I have. I 
don't know what it is. He's a creature. Well, you just have to look at him to see that. He even tried to kill us. But just... But... You can't get him out of your mind. Can't get him out of my head, out of my mind, out of the time. Here comes Ego, the wandering caveman of Justin. That's my job for about two more years. If I can hold on to you that long, then it'll be up to somebody else. Maybe him, huh? Ah, casual 1960 hey. sexism. Where you been? Belting out a tune just for you in there. I look up and you're gone. We can hear every word, Tom. I said hear, not understand. You're funny, Mr. Miller. Really funny. Come on, Rocky, let's dance. Wait a minute. What's the matter? I thought I heard sirens. Oh, uh, that's Dino's sax. It leaks. Can we just get to the end of the caveman movie, please, for the love of Jesus? Ah, uh, finally, they're doing what the police do best, racial profiling. We're the police! We're here to racially profile the caveman! Shooting would end the movie, and we have to get for more of this jabroni's music. This jabroni's music is killing me, chat. I mean it literally. I used my power of King Crimson to get to the end of the movie. Wow. In the arms of the caveman, far away from here. You really do like Gluck Buddy Holly, you know that, right? And so, Ega died the way he lived, being a caveman. 